Hi. Hello, everyone. Uh, welcome to this uh, short training video. So as we know, like Safe 6.0 has been released last month and uh, there have been some updates which we all can access through Scaled Agile Framework site. Uh, so in today's video, I'm just going to share what has been the update in terms of safe core values. So I just found that uh, interesting and I thought of, you know, uh, sharing this short video on the core values updates. So we will understand like what were the core values earlier and what are the changes in safe 6.0 in terms of core values also we will try to understand new core values using a short acronym which i am calling it as car so let us start so these were the old core values and uh, i did a video on the old core values which i will share a link in the description you guys can please check the details of that video as well so earlier before safe 6.0 uh, the old core values were alignment built-in quality program execution and transparency so when safe talked about you know alignment as a core value that means you know when the multiple teams are involved in the safe implementation those teams needs to be aligned with the program and the portfolio uh, you know the vision that uh, has been placed by the program and the portfolio the strategy the business strategy also in terms of the priority so if, if the teams are not aligned they will miss on the priorities and there will be some gaps and uh, the objective and the goal that uh, we want to achieve at a program and portfolio level uh, you know that will be missed so alignment is uh, very much required when all the teams are working together in the same our train or the same program objectives Second old core values was built in quality. So that means, you know, whatever we are delivering, uh, quality is of utmost importance, right? I mean, uh, there are multiple teams working for the same program objective. There are multiple teams which are part of the art, but I mean, the quality uh, in terms of, you know, the releases quality in terms of, you know, the way we are delivering our work, uh, that's the foundation of, you know, uh, as the core, val uh, core value of safe. Third one was the program execution. Uh, that means, you know, how the different teams uh, work and align with the different, uh, you know, uh, align with the same program objectives. How, when, you know, the concept of the art, the agile release train, the multiple teams are part of the team, same team, and, uh, you know, they are executing. There is a similar cadence uh, followed uh, when it comes of uh, team sprints. Also, the, all teams start with a PI. So, I mean, the overall approach about the program execution and the last one was the transparency transparency or the visibility in each layer of the safe implementation be it when, when we call about the portfolio level that means you know the things are rightly communicated things are transparent also at a program level you know where the teams are doing the pi planning they have a clear-cut objective uh, they have a clear-cut directions about you know uh, what's the goal of the pi and uh, what exactly we want to achieve what's the business strategy what's been the priority for the business and teams are also making their work visible so that is very easy for anyone to identify any blockages any impediments so transparency is pretty much required if the teams are not transparent if the management is not transparent i mean we will miss out on certain things and uh, the bottlenecks cannot be diagnosed as well as you know certain information uh, cannot be rightly uh, interpreted so these were kind of like the old core values which were a foundation of uh, the safe configurations before 6.0 now let us understand like you know what are the new core values so these are the four new updated core values where alignment and transparency are still there but i mean safe has introduced two new core values one is the respect for people so that simply means i mean we need to build teams or we need to create an environment for our teams where there is a trust there is a collaboration or there is a respect right i mean uh, ultimately whatever the product that we are trying to build it's built by the teams it's built by the people so we need to create a right environment where there is a trust openness the transparency and there is kind of a mutual collaboration within the team as well as the other teams so that's kind of a core foundation of uh, safe and the other one which has been introduced is the relentless improvement so that means you know continuous improvement in all our practices 
when we beat like the process that we are using beat like the tools the technology i mean identifying the areas where uh, uh, we need to improve as a team where we need to improve as a program where we need to improve as a group and uh, you know uh, uh, continuously uh, you know reflecting on those opportunities con continuously reflecting on the things i mean when we talk about the scrum teams the team uh, do the retrospective at the end of the sprint similarly during the pi how we are doing and uh, there is a concept of you know uh, whole like optimizing the whole so that's why they have introduced this new core value like uh, continuously improving or uh, they are calling it as a relentless improvement so these are the new core values and uh, i have termed a acronym called card so using card we can remember the new core values where c stands for continuous improvement a for alignment r for respect for people and t stands for transparency so that was pretty much about this short video i hope you guys liked it and if you are new to this channel please subscribe thank you